All right, our pet of the week is Milo. He's a six month old kitten who's super sweet, actually, a staff favorite. Milo is great with kids and other cats. You can check out Milo at the North Texas Humane Society's Fort Worth location on East Lancaster Avenue. It is open every day from noon until six. All right, it is Wild Wednesday. Kristen Garrett with the Fort Worth Zoo joins us now in studio. Tell us about who you brought. This is Bellatrix. And she is a Burmese python. Wow. Uh, she's beautiful. And, uh, but I'm sitting here amazed at, at how calm you are holding her. <laughs> and you were telling us some, some tricks of how you hold her. Yeah, I mean, you just always be careful around any snakes. Um, obviously, we work with these animals every day, but don't go out in the wild and pick right. up a snake. But, you know, you just want to be careful of how, to where her head is and just support her body weight. Right. Anytime you come up on a snake, is there a difference in how you can tell if it's poisonous or non-poisonous? Um, well, we... It's, there's no surefire trick. Okay. It's, you know, people say triangular head means it's venomous, but that's not always true. There's lots of non venomous snakes that will mimic the venomous. <laughs> yeah, she's a handful. <laughs> yeah, and she's not even fully grown. So tell, she's how, how long is she now? She's just shy of eight feet and she weighs about 40 pounds, but full grown, she'll probably be between 15 and 18 feet wow. and weigh 150 to 200 pounds. All right, now you have a yeah. great weekend coming up for uh, the Heroes and Veterans. Tell us a little bit about it. We do. It is our Heroes Day weekend, um, and it's for veterans, active duty military, first responders. It's the 8th, 9th, and 10th of November. Um, so all weekend, and we'll have fun events like um, keeper chats and, you know, weather dependent. We'll have our animal show going mm -hmm. on. I mean, it's just our way of saying thank you. Oh, to very cool. Those people. Most people think they're slimy. These, these are snakes who are not slimy. They're not slimy. The only way a snake is going to be slimy is if they've crawled through something slimy. Uh -huh. um, they're Scales are very shiny, and it gives them that wet right. look. Um, but yeah, they are not slimy at, at all. At least you're gonna touch. Beautiful snake. I may wait till after the <laughs> so I can take my time. All right. Well, thanks for watching CBS 11 News, the ones for Texas. And we'll